Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. I'm Melissa. I'm Garrett. And we are The Leffersons, and welcome to Vlogmas Day 17! Uh, dun, 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 dun. We are getting so much closer to Christmas. Mm -hmm. We're almost a week away from Christmas, which is crazy to think about. If you don't know, we're gonna be in Disney World for Christmas. So we'll leave our Disney World trip announcement up here and down below with everything that we're doing, all the Christmassy things we're doing. But today we don't really have a Christmas thing. Nope. We are opening our next... Uh, backstage. Our Disney Backstage Collection. So This is our third time with it. Yes. Uh, we committed to three months with it mm -hmm. just to kind of see what it was. Mm -hmm. And so far it's been pretty fun. We'll link the other ones that we did uh, around. Basically what Disney Backstage Collection is, is it is from the actual, it's from Disney. It is a Disney subscription service, but it's actually from the company of Disney. There's a lot of Disney subscription services that are not actually from Disney. This is coming from Disney. It's coming from the archives of Disney, actually. We've had a, we've gotten a lot of cool things so far, so. So this month is... <laughs> yes! The, the, the Three Caballeros. The three caballeros, three gay caballeros, they say they are birds of a feather. Oh, so there so you go. Good. So they come in this little tube, and it has a bunch of the art um, related to them. So I, I don't know their names. I don't know their names either, but we do love that song. We do love the ride. <laughs> and we're excited to see. They always give you a little blurb with like information about what it all, what everything means and what it all is. We looked at the names because we felt, we felt like we needed to know the names. <laughs> so there's Panchito Pistoles and Donald, obviously, and Jose Car Carioca, Carioca? I don't know if we're Ho saying that right. We're going with, go we're gonna go with Jose. <laughs> Jose. <laughs> so on the back of each card, and I'm gonna hold it here for a hot minute. On the back it says, in the 1944 world premiere of Disney's Three Caballeros, Audiences encountered a wildly experimental animated musical that shunned traditional animation and editing styles. It was too progressive for one of the three animation directors, but Walt Disney loved it. And though the story is in part inspired from 1920s vaudeville, the film is very much a product of its time. Proof of this can be seen in the sketches on your tea and pin, a Mexican charro rooster, South American parrot, and American duck which reflect the sentiments of the 1940s good neighbor policy. Oh. So that's interesting. I didn't, I didn't know the historical uh, aspect of right. each of the, the three caballeros. Yeah, so you, in every box we have gotten this little backer card that explains everything and then we also get a t-shirt and a pin. T-shirt. So, oh no. Donde esta la pin? Maybe it's in here. in the t-shirt. Oh, it's not? Nope. Oh, okay. It was in the bag. <laughs> because it, it, the, the lid had popped off. Oh, okay, that makes sense. What's the pin? What's the pin? Cool. It's a guitar. That's cool. All right, so. So this pin is pretty cool. This is what it looks like. Hopefully you can see it okay. It's dark outside, so the lighting's a little weird, but there's the three Cabaneros right there. And if you can see, it kind of looks like it's in a frame, but there's guitars on the top and on the bottom. That is so fun. These pins have all been super duper cool. And on the back, it also says Disney Backstage Collection. I say this every time. I wonder if these are limited edition. Maybe they're not, I don't know, but they're still really cool pins. So then also included is a t-shirt. So, oh, this is- Oh, wow. <laughs> there's, there's a lot happening on that t-shirt. Are you gonna wear that, Garrett? I don't know if I can. <laughs> so, uh -huh. I'm gonna flip it around here real quick. Oh my quick. gosh. <laughs> so it has buttons. It has buttons. It the has others, buttons. The others have just been regular t-shirts. But it has sketches of the three caballeros. Let me see if I can get a good one for you. So there's the three caballeros, but it's all um, like the design sketches yeah. from it. And then on the sleeve, they always have like little patches. <coughs> and so they have a little patch of the caballeros. And then also inside of the collar, <laughs> aha, my friends, bienvenidos. Uh, bienvenidos cuentos, Panchito, right there in the top there. So fun, I love the little sayings in the inside of the I'm shirt, that's my favorite to... part. And then there's also like writing on there. Yeah, it's like the date. It says, Art yeah, props. the date of things, 
Yeah, interesting. There's just like little scribbles and stuff around. That's a very interesting shirt. It also seems like very see-through. Like it, like you can see my hand through it. Can you see my hand through it? Maybe it doesn't show, but it's super duper see-through. Maybe see I'll wear another shirt underneath it to hide yeah. everything. So I have to say, <laughs> kind of a downfall of Disney backstage collection is yeah, you don't really know what you're going to get and yeah, you this isn't really towards your preferences. Like last month we got Toy Story and we got a bright yellow shirt, which oh. if I would have gotten it in my size, I probably would have worn it, but Garrett's probably never gonna wear it because nope. he never wears yellow. I don't know if you're gonna wear that shirt either. I'll wear it to Epcot. You'll wear it to Epcot? Yeah, okay. let's wash it and then see what happens. See what happens? Yeah. We'll have to try it on and see yeah. how it is, but um, the pins have been super cool. I definitely really like the pins. The pins are awesome. I like getting the archives. Like mm -hmm. that's that's super duper cool. I just don't know if we're gonna continue this. Probably I not. I don't think we will. No. Um, I think it's been fun and yeah. it's been interesting. I I'm interested to see what like I'll watch other people's. Do. Yeah, we definitely want to watch other unboxings. If you, if any of you are gonna continue getting this service, please comment down below and let us know if you have a YouTube channel so we can check out your. Mm -hmm. We'd love to keep seeing what everyone's getting. I just wish. Like if I knew that there was a month that it was gonna be like Winnie the Pooh or like something like that, like I would totally jump on it. But I don't know. It's just kind of hit or miss with us, you know? Yeah, but so it was overall. cool and it's different and it's it's cool to get things from the archives. Like Agreed. no one at, you can't go to a store and buy these things. Nope. So that that's what's cool about it. And leave a comment down below. Let us know what you think about this service. If a lot of you guys have been leaving lots of comments on the previous videos too, which has been great. So thank you so much. But that's it for the unboxing. Now we just have to open our pin for today. Yes. Pin 17. Let's see. I think it's in there. It's in here. Yeah. So this is our advent calendar, okay? And we actually got our pins from Magic Launch Bay. They are a Disney um, company. They send pins from all around the world. They have an Instagram and a Facebook. We'll leave it down below. This is what they look like. They're in these little blind bags. And this has been so fun opening these. They have been pretty awesome. They're They've great been, pins. Yeah, we've been getting so many international ones and so many limited editions. Our Vlogmas playlist will be linked down below. If you have not watched our videos, if you're new here, you can check it out. Oh my gosh! You were just talking about how you like these guys. I was talking about in our previous video how I love the little green aliens because Alien Swirling Saucers is an amazing ride. Comment down below if you agree. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Okay, so this is from Hong Kong Disneyland. Hidden Mickey, four of 19. There's only 19 of those pins in the world? <laughs> no. But here is the little green alien. It's like a silhouette. It is. He is so cute. I love the colors on all the Hong Kong pins. They're just so vibrant and beautiful. Oh, love it. I wish Disney, I wish America would up their pin game, honestly. Uh, right? They really need to up their pin game. But this is so cute. And just another wonderful pin from Magic Launch Bay. They have been killing it, honestly. Yep. Just, oh. This one we're gonna keep for sure. We have a Toy Story collection. So it's this one we will, we, will, we will keep. Fun! <sighs> thank you so much Magic Launch Bay again for sending us those pins. I don't think we thank you in every video even though we paid for them. So you're welcome for also giving you service. <laughs> but thank you because this has really been so much fun. Good like stuff. the highlight of our vlog this mm -hmm. for sure. Easily. That's it for today's video. Thank you again so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it that big thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Let us know what you thought about Disney Backstage Collection for this month. And let us know if you're going to continue the service if you mm -hmm. have been getting it. And also subscribe to our channel for more Disney content. Yay! Because we have Vlogmas. And after Vlogmas, there's just going to be more Disney things. Exactly. And us just being our weird selves. So if you think that we're cool, then you should subscribe. And hit that notification bell icon so you don't miss another video. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye, guys. Bonus, Garrett put on the shirt. Here it is, guys. <laughs> um, I'm gonna wash it and see what happens. It's, all of these shirts have had a really weird fit, haven't they? I'm not gonna wear a t-shirt underneath it and just. <laughs> Let your chest hair hang out. A <laughs> oh, man.